suffering. No one wants to go there. This is how bad this place is. You'll be saved from that place. And that place when you go there, if it's Jannah or Jahannam, which is hellfire, Jannah is the paradise and Jahannam is the hellfire, yeah, yeah. there is no end. There is no death. You live forever and forever. You know how the feeling... The same like what it is to me. Yeah. I'm not nothing, but look at the same. Like if you are good, if you are good, if you, are good you go to paradise or hell. I think you, the thing that you just told me, I mean, it's the same to me. Like I think all the religions, if you are good, then it's good. What is good? Yeah. Who decides what is so, good? That's what he said. Like, if you are kind to your family, if you are communicating with your yeah, friends. Yeah. And worship, most importantly, as you are pointing out, the most importantly, it's not about the rights of people, rights, but the rights the environment has upon us, rights the animal have upon us, the right of God. What is the right of God? The right of God is that you worship and are grateful to Him alone without ascribing any partners to Him. You know there are like people, do you know, there are people who worship a monkey? There are people who worship a rat? There are people who worship stone. stones? There are people who worship man or a woman? This is violating the rights of God. And if you violate that right of God, God has already clearly clearly communicated to us saying you will go to hellfire and that will be the only abode and there will be no coming out from it but look man let's say that i i, I go to the stone every day every day yeah man, but but the whole but the whole my whole my life i protect people i help people i i, I don't think good but i worship stone yeah. very good question why should you deserve the reward from someone that gave you a purpose to fulfill. Instead of fulfilling that purpose, you went against the purpose and you did something else on the contrary. To give you to give you an example, to give you an example. Suppose you are employed by a company, right? The company said, this is what you have to do. You have to work for this, do these projects, and then this is what we'll do. Our company will will meet its requirement, right? That's what the company has employed you for to do that. Instead of doing that, you say, yeah, I know you, you, my employer. You go to the rival company and do their works, right? Their projects, all of it. Their competitors, for example. Now, do you expect your employer to reward you for doing the works of someone else and not doing the works of your company? You're doing good because the other company, what you're doing, even though they're rivals, you're actually doing good things. Good job, maybe you're developing a software, yeah, you're manufacturing you know. a car, maybe whatever you're doing, the other companies is a doing good thing. It's not bad, but you're doing something good, but you're not actually fulfilling what you're required to do. If God created you to worship Him, and instead of worshiping Him, you worship the stone, why do you then say, I still seek the reward from you, God? when I'm worshipping the stone. But if, if, God, if God knew that human would have the capacity to choose bad, why, why would he create us in the first place? If he knew, he would do that. You see, the creation or creating is the prerogative of God. If God creates, it's because he's the creator. He creates as wills. He can create creation with no free will. He can create creation with free will only due to good. He can create creation with free will only to do evil or he can create creation who can do good or evil depending on what they want to do. God can create any of them and this is the power and majesty of God that he can create like that. He created the angels. Can the angels do anything bad? No. They can't. No. We have to go. Yeah? It's been nice talking to you Tim. Man. We talk again but um, have you read the Quran? Just one, one second. Have you read the Quran? No. I have a copy of the... No Bible, nothing. nothing. No, 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 no. I know, I know, no, I know. No, read the Bible? No, no, no. I know Swiss, uh, which, which, where are you from, you said? Greece. Greece. There are Greek translations. Please get a hold of them. But I have an English translation of the Quran here. Um, it's an easy to read. Read this Quran with an open heart. Because the Quran talks to you. It doesn't talk to me only. It, it will talk to you. It addresses you as a human being. It addresses you as a creation. And then you'll discover about the reality. Discover about you God. Can you personal experience about, about Muslims? 
Which in is my weird. country, in my thank you, man, in my country, Greece, all Muslims are something bad. Like all the news, like Muslims, Muslims, it's something bad. Mm. In my personal experience, yeah. I went to Egypt like three, two years ago. People told me, no, don't go to Egypt. It's dangerous. It's, it's, it's dangerous, dangerous. I said, oh, I go. And I want everyone like local, not to everything local, local bus, local, local. Me and my girlfriend. And I'm in the bus. It's like it's around Eastern, Eastern period, Eastern, like in, it's Eastern. You know Eastern, Eastern. And I'm in the bus, like close to midnight. And suddenly the bus stops, and the bus driver says something in Arab, blah 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 blah. And everybody clap 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 clap. And I thought, what happened? I was scared. What happened? Clap clap. And then the guy told me that the bus driver told them that because right now it's the uh, something about the Jesus existing Quran. And so they have to respect Christians because right now it's uh, the what's the name in English when Jesus reborn. Right. 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 Yeah. So we stop the bus for one hour for, to respect Christianity. And I, was, I said, what? This could never happen in Greece. Like in Greece, you don't care about Muslim, bad Muslims, bad Muslims, and there. In a local bus, guys, in a local bus, the bus stopped uh, for the Christianity. And also, everybody was helping me, everybody. Like, my person has been from Muslims, perfect. Perfect. Come and join us, bro. Anyway, it's been, it's been, it's been, a, pleasure. It's been a pleasure speaking to you, so please read the Quran, and if you have time again, come, come back again and speak like to us. Too, I'm honest, I'm nothing. But I just love people, like all of you. Like if you're good with me, man, I love you. If you're good with me, care, I love you. Care. That's that's my like my personal. Take experience. care. It's a pleasure speaking to you. You take care. Yeah, me too. Guys. And may God guide us all Come closer and closer to the truth. <laughs> right. I'm fucking so the angels we are talking about, the angels are created, but they cannot go.